Hi guys, um, today we'll demonstrate how this Magento pre-order module works and why you need to have a pre-order system in your Magento web shop. And the very common reason is that suppose that if you want to start um, your new web shop or you want to add a new product uh, which isn't arrived yet at your warehouse but still you want to showcase in your catalog. So the best way to do is to put the product as a pre-order so or the back order kind of thing in a different language and why it is essential is that so that the people who are regular visitor of your shop can see that and they can you know they can put it as a bookmark or kind of wish list so that when the product is available they can purchase the product so in this way you can increase the sale of your um, uh, web shop your product and also can increase the um, conversion rates as well so the other reason the other reason is about um, to reduce the bounce rate suppose that if you have a product let's say you have iPhone 6 and the product goes out of stock and so you have two choices either you disable the product or you just let it be as out of stock so both of both things are bad really bad people are coming from different different social media channels or youtube or google or other other, other search engines and when they come into your shop they saw that oh this the product is out of stock or it's 404 it's not available in both the cases the bounce first of all in out of stock obviously the people will close your window and in this way the bounce rate will go up that is not considered as a best practice if you're running an e-commerce website so why this pre-order is really important is you can really really reduce your um, bounce rate as well as you can increase your conversions so how this um, module does works and how you can install it I'll explain in the detail so after purchasing the product it's like it's very cheap $39 that's nothing you can purchase the product through store.webcool.com and after the purchase you'll get uh, the software as a gem so how you can install the module is very simple it's like um, what you need to do is you need to just um, move the app as per this screenshot by the way you can find the user guide um, right here under this user guide section you can see under the demo and the user guide you can check the user guide. so the installation of the module is pretty easy you just move to your app and js folder into the magento root parallel to the app folder and it will install the pre-order extension Suppose that if you're getting some, when you are logging into the admin panel and when you will navigate pre-order options, it may happen that you get the 404. So nothing to worry, you need to just log out and then log in again and it will work perfectly. Uh, many times Magento does not allow the resources in the table, in the database, so it may cause some issue, but uh, after the login and logout, it will work perfectly fine. So after the installation of the module and flushing the cache, you will see there's an admin panel like that. You can see here, uh, you will see under the web cool tab, under the configuration, you will see there's a pre-order module and you will see there's a pre-order type, pre-order, I'll explain one by one. So what is this pre-order type? Pre-order type module offers um, different type of um, there's two type of pre-order one is the percent payment and the one is the complete payment so what how can you do that is like um if you want to have a percent payment like um you want to set the product um 33 or 34 36 kind of percent payment as a down payment and rest after when the product will be arrived in the catalog so this is useful in that case but many people want it as a complete payment like suppose that if you want to have a iphone 6 and you want the complete payment from the buyer you can set it as a complete payment so it will work in this way
below that you can set I means what amount of um, percent you want to put over there so you can put it and next next option is enable pre-order for you want to put as a per product all product few product or all products except one and you'll see the changes options will be changed as per the option select if you'll see all product if you'll see per product and few product you'll see the options are there and you can set if you'll it's quite readable you can easily navigate through the options um, like send email to the customer that's a very important feature that automatically you can send the email or you can choose it as a manual and you can set the email id which you want to put and that's all yeah the configuration setup is all done what you need to do at the product end is like um let's say this is a swiss moment sport watch jewelry and make sure as you can see after the installation of the module you'll see there's a pre-order status that is enabled and the pre-order product availability date is in there i just set it as okay it's quite long but let's say as for the demo i just put it as a 2018 and what you need to do make sure the inventory is out of stock that's a key factor if your product is not out of the stock then obviously the button will not appear and the pre-order will not display at the front end so means let's say if i just put it as um, and wow it's a product with the swiss moment sport watch with the original prices in there and the pay 165 dollar with the pre-order and these are the custom op custom messages you can put in the configuration and that will display this thing this product will be stock soon and for the verification by the way this is the demo page it will whenever you will click on the pre-order demo it will redirect you to this page okay so what do you need to do all right let me navigate to the back end of the module so you can see this message which is coming here it is coming from the back end which you have so you can put it anything and it will display okay so now i'm a i'm a buyer and i just purchased this product let's say i did the proceed to check out and then i purchase it then what will happen uh, you'll see in the order page let me navigate to the order page then and it's really very easy it means the administrator you can see the order mode is in there and you can see there's a normal or pre-order so you can easily find and filter and search the pre-order module let me open a one the pre-order and you'll see the order status pending and everything is fine and you can see the order mode is pre-ordered so admin can easily identify that the product is pre-ordered or it's a normal one okay so let's see everything is fine and buyer make the payment so how does the buyer know that let's say buyer have a more than uh, 10 orders from the same shop how he'll know that the simple product is in the pre-order state and that's very easy if you'll navigate to the user guide you will see right there by the way it module will work with all the product type either it's a simple or configurable or bundle or group or downloadable or virtual it will work with all type of magento product and we have clearly explained in our user guide so as you can see here in this screenshot we have explained that if this order 30 is in pending state and this is pre-order the order will be completed when product will be in stock so you can see right there is the message which is displaying so when the buyer will navigate his order he'll see this message and then he can easily identify that okay this part is in there okay so and you can see this is let's say the product has been arrived 
and the buyer has notified then the buyer can make the payment if the payment is being done as a percentage payment or the partial payment so that's why module is also very useful in the partial payment system means you don't need to pay your buyer don't need to pay anything like everything upfront you can build your web shop based on the pre-order system if you want to accept as a partial payment and as per described in the user guide you can check it out over there and you'll see there's a pre-order tab and which can be navigated under the system here so and as you can see here at the front end this module will work with any kind of template uh, you can use any kind of responsive web template or any kind of template and this module will work fantas fantastically with um, responsive or using SAS or less or any kind of template it will work perfectly fine so if you have any query or question regarding this pre-order or back order system um, I'll put the link of the store and you can remember it's pretty easy it's store.webcool.com and if you have any query or question you can directly reach us, reach us out by clicking the contact us link and if you can you can send you can drop us a message and we'll surely look into that if you have any query or question don't hesitate to let us know and we will try our best to solve it as soon as possible thanks for watching